hello everyone welcome to my channel and in this tutorial i am going to explain you what is views in sql and also i am going to explain the significance of views how to create them and also how to drop the view by using drop command views in sql are kind of a virtual tables a view also has rows and columns as they are in the real table in the database we can create a view by selecting fields from one or more table present in the database a view can either have all the rows of a table or specific rows based on a certain condition views allows users to structure data in a way that users or classes of users find natural or intuitive it restricts access to the data in a such a way that user can see and modify exactly what they need and no more it also summarizes the data from various tables which we can use to generate reports this is the basic syntax for creating and dropping the view let me show you with some simple example this is the sql command line interface and today we are going to create a view over employees table let me show you its metadata the sc employees so these are the column names and the data type for the employees table in the first example we will create a view which retrieves employee id first name last name and salary from the employees table and we are also going to use some where condition on salary column let me show you how to do it to create a view just type create view now we have to give a view name in this case we will give employee view as now we have to use select command here select we will be retrieving the only the four columns which are employee id first name last name and salary employee id first name last name salary from the table name which is employees now we can also use the where condition to further limit the data so we will be using where condition on salary column where salary greater than 10000 after semicolon and enter now the view has been created let me show you how it look likes for this just type select star from now we have to give a view name here so we just created the employees view let me give this employees view semicolon and enter here you can see this is our employees view here you can see employees view retrieves employee id first name last name and salary column from the employees table in which the salary is greater than 10000 as you can see you have to remember one thing clearly this is not a table which stored in the database it is just a virtual table which retrieves the data from the employees table employees is the actual table which is stored in the database for this just type update now we have to give the view name which is employees view set now we have to give column name here we will update first name here first name equals to in quotation raj where employee id equals to 
100. After hitting semicolon and enter, one row is updated. Let me show you how it look like. Select star from employees view. Now you can see the first name is updated to Raj for the employee ID 100. To delete the entire view, we have to use drop command here. Let me show you how to use it. For this, just type drop view and we have to give view name here. Employees view. And here you can see the view is dropped. Now, if we retrieve the data from this view, it will show table or view does not exist. It is that simple. So, in this tutorial, we have seen what is view, significance of view, how to create a view, how to update it, and how to drop it with some simple examples. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and also ring the notification bell to get latest updates.